but we begin with brand new video showing the moment deputies find Nathaniel Abraham after he didn't show up in court. Pays him! Pays him, Bernie! The Oakland County Sheriff says Abraham punched three deputies right before that video started. And this all happened after he failed to show up to be arraigned on charges of indecent exposure. All of it adding a, a sad new chapter in the life of a man who was convicted of murder at the age of 11. Defender Kevin Dietz has followed Abraham's story now for actually decades, and he was in the courtroom today. Another major setback for him, Kevin. Yes, and always controversial. The Sheriff's Department says Nathaniel Abraham took a fighting stance and started swinging at deputies. One deputy has a contusion on his head and his knee and is off work for a week. They say they had no choice but to tase him today. Nathaniel Abraham's new mug shot after missing a court date, then fleeing police and allegedly punching at them. Oakland County Sheriff's deputies tased Abraham to bring him in. He starts fighting with the deputies. Two of them get glancing blows to the head, one gets a scratch on the nose. A fourth deputy in uniform shows up and uh, ultimately had to deploy a taser in order to get him down on the ground and take him into custody. Tase him! Tase him, Bernie! In the neighborhood where it went down, people looked at video that popped up on Facebook of the tasing. Some say deputies were too aggressive. I seen that he was, I seen him running, and then I heard the taser. Like, they just kept tasing him. He just kept saying, can y'all please stop tasering me? Abraham has a long history of controversial run-ins with police. At age 11, he was convicted of murder and sentenced as a juvenile. He got out at 21. That day, he was wearing a fur coat as he left prison. A short time later, he was involved in drugs and arrested again. This week, fresh out of prison, he was again arrested for indecent exposure. Then this morning, he was supposed to be in court and did not show. Local 4 legal expert Neil Rockine says today's events could be serious trouble for Nathaniel Abraham. I mean, if he was looking to go back to prison, he found a way to do it. And the tasing today was also captured on patrol car cam. That was not made public today, but it will be turned over to the prosecutors who are evaluating the case. Kevin Dietz, Defenders. And in the end, Kevin, uh, what does all this, this mean as far as new charges go? Yeah, he was supposed to be in court today to be charged with the indecent exposure. Obviously, when he gets to court, he will face those charges. Now they may also add on resisting an assault, but that will be up to prosecutors who are going to look at all of this video and make a decision yeah. shortly. All right, Kevin.